Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm doing a requested video, which is so much fun. This is my everyday makeup look. So Monday through Friday, I'm on camera, so it is like full coverage, full glam. There is no time for dewy skin, radiant skin. No, it has to be like matte full coverage. So whenever I'm not at work and it's just the weekend or I'm gonna teach spin, I like to have a flawless face, but I like it more radiant and dewy and glowy. So this is my no makeup makeup look. So the first step that I do is use this Pixi Day Dew. It's like a, a glotion, if you will. I got this at Target and it's a white iridescent like primer. I don't even really think it's a primer, but I like to really lather this all over my skin because it gives like such a beautiful glow. You can see, kind of like that shimmer glow. So usually on my days off, it's me running around or working out. So I love this It Cosmetics foundation. It's a CC cream. I also have it in a serum that's a full foundation. I just love it because you literally can sweat in it and you don't break out. So if I can work out in something and my skin looks flawless, you know that's a product for me. So now that I have my base on, I love to go in and really like waken up my skin with a good bronze. But because it's my day off and I really want to look like my skin's very healthy and dewy, I like to use a cream contour. So the one I use is by NYX and it's called Deep Golden. You can see it's really dark. So all I do, which is really nice, it's on like this doe foot applicator. I just make like a little line here underneath my cheekbone, up here on my forehead. Although this is a drugstore product, it's very pigmented. So I just take a damp beauty blender or damp beauty sponge, whatever you have. And I just bring this into my hairline, blend it in to my contour and just really like liven up the skin. And you're going to see a major difference. And now we go in with the concealer. So the one I use for my like no makeup makeup look, if you will, is by Born This Way. It's a radiant concealer. Now, a lot of people think it's full coverage. I don't think it's full coverage, but maybe that's because I have like a really like blue vein, so I have to be really careful. But I use this just like I would when I'm wearing a full coverage makeup for work. I don't play. When it comes to concealer, just all the way. I don't care. And now we set everything. So I still use my brightening powder by Laura Mercier. So now when it comes to my bronzer and really powdering my face, this is when I just use that butter bronzer from Physicians Formula. Y'all asked me what it was before. I actually only use the bronzer color. Like that's the color of it. Cause I know there's like three different ones, but mine's just the bronzer one. So I use a little bit of this in my mirror. Hit the temples. Honestly, that's what makes such a difference is when you hit the temples in your forehead when you bronze because that's really where the sun hits you. Really get in in that hairline. You have to be careful when you're blonde because then your hair turns like orange. Have you guys ever noticed that? Next up, we do blush because blush makes everything complete. But I know that NYX has really good blushes, e.l.f. makes really pigmented blushes, L'Oreal has them, or Revlon. Whatever one is your favorite, MAC Mocha is like a really good one. I'm actually using this like raspberry, strawberry looking, like very Hawaiian looking blush by Becca. It's uh, their Chrissy Teigen palette. Do you guys ever see this? The Chrissy Teigen one, it has the bronzer, the highlighter and the blush. But I love this blush because it just like is a kiss of color, which is really nice. Now I place all of this on. So before I put on mascara, one last thing that I do because I want this to look as natural as possible, I will take just a brush that is a foundation brush, but not really dense, if you will. So one of your like 
less dense brushes and no product goes on this and I just buff everything. Just buff everything. Smooth it on out, make everything look as natural as possible. So y'all are gonna think I'm crazy because I don't fill in my eyebrows when I do everyday makeup, like at all. They're already really dark, so you kind of think that I have them filled in, but I don't. I just use clear brow gel, put them in place. I don't put any eyeliner on. And now for the final touch, mascara. You know I love me some Luminous Lash Paradise L'Oreal Mascara. I only do the top lash and I only do one coat. But I do a very generous coat. Last but not least, I love to have a good color on your lip that's like a sheen pop of color. And this one by Revlon is called Pink Kismo. Pink Kismo, I think. It's a raspberry, like, berry pink that's iridescent. I usually put this over like a really good lipstick, but today, just the gloss. Hope you guys enjoyed this look, super easy to achieve, but if you're running out the door and you can only use like two products, the products I would go for is the CC Cream and this Day Dew Lotion by Pixi, because it won't make you break out, but you'll still have that like glowy, dewy, radiant finish. Hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you next time.